So, in Power World, ingots are an incredible resource. They are used a lot, and in order to craft an ingot, you need ores, and then you also need the primitive furnace, which is here. And then you're going to also need a pal that has the kindling ability. So you'll see that I've got a pal working on ingots right now. And there are multiple ways you can get your hands on ingots. You can just use a standard pickaxe if you go for the stone one at the start. It's going to take a very, very long time. If you go for the metal one, if we smack this, you'll see that I'm getting ores. I'm getting them quite often. But the thing is, because I'm using a metal pickaxe, it's then going to cost ingots to repair. So what you want to do to make it the most efficient is get yourself to level 19. And then when you are level 19 or thereabouts, I did it a little bit earlier, but I recommend just waiting until level 19 because there isn't really any point actually going for this specific pal until you are level 19 because you can't do much and i'll explain exactly what i mean when we get to that stage but basically right here so this is where you start the game the plateau of beginnings if you come all the way up here to this beachy area right here what you're going to do when you get to the beach is be very very careful because it is incredibly hot i managed to find a little spot where it wasn't too hot but you are looking for a pal that should just be roaming around like this. I finally found one. But in front of us is a dig toys. And what you want to do is capture them. I managed to do it. I'll put the footage on screen now. You'll see that I was uh, quite a low level for it. And what I did was use the mega spheres. So the second one you'll come across. And there was a little bit of luck involved. But I did manage to capture the dig toys. If you want to avoid being too hot on the beach where the dig toys are, then what you can do at level 16 is you can get the heat resistant pelt armor. So it helps to fend off the heat. But the reason you're going to wait until you're level 19 is because when you hit level 19, you unlock the key item dig toys is headband. And the reason you want the headband at level 19 is because if we chuck dig toys at this rock, without the headband, you're going to be doing one damage. Whereas as soon as you've got the headband, if we quickly go to the party, when activated, begin shell spin, follows the player while spinning, allowing the efficient destruction of ore. So instead of that one, because you've got the headband on, instead of doing one damage every time he spins, He's going to deal between, I'd say, 16 and 20. There's a lot faster, and you'll see how quick he shreds through the ore. And when he's done, all you do is simply run through it all, grab all the ore, and then providing you can carry enough, you can just take it all back to your base. And then what you can do is you can get your pals to work on it in the furnace and turn it into ingots. And then one more little tip to help you guys out is if we go to the fast travel system over to so this is again the base the plateau of beginnings if you come over to here where you've got the red area the very south of it you've got the desolate church if you make it to the desolate church and you simply go around to the back of it you're going to see there are a lot of stones that you can mine that are going to give you ore. each and every one of them do so it depends on your carrying capacity on how much you can take back each time these rocks do respawn every now and then I think it's like every in-game day they will respawn. And if you have Cativa, so if we go to the power deck quickly, Cativa is number two. If you have these, each one you have in your team is going to increase your carrying capacity. So that's going to help you take even more resources back. But if we go one more time, if I chuck Dig Toys out, that's all you got to do. you got to throw him at the rock and he does his own thing. And then after a while, you're going to have lots and lots and lots of ore which you can smelt into ingots. So all you need is level 19. You need dig toys because he does the shell spin and you need his headband so that he's efficient with it and actually deals more than one damage each time he deals damage with the spin. And then come to the desolate church every time the rocks respawn and just farm away. And that is also going to do it for this video. Let me know your thoughts and stuff about this farming method for ore in the comments. I will see you guys in the next one. I hope you enjoyed it. I hope it helped you out. Thank you for watching.